What's up everybody and welcome back to Grippin' and Rippin'. Uh, if you saw the last video, uh, phew, my dad and I flipped the kayak, fell in the pond. It was, it was quite the fiasco. So uh, I'm out here today by myself. I'm gonna try to launch this thing without flipping it and uh, get out there and catch some fish. So I think what we're gonna do today, this is a shallow pond, uh, big fish in it. So uh, they haven't been biting a lot lately. So I wanna try to size it down a bit and see if uh, I can put something right in front of their face that they're gonna just uh, absolutely destroy. A meal that they just can't pass up. So uh, let's get out there and get after it. So I think this might do the trick. Uh, it's smaller, it's more lifelike. It's cold right now, so try to fish something that's uh, gonna look alive and real. So we're gonna get right out here to a spot that I know is the deepest part of this pond. And um, I'd say the water's probably low 40s, high, high 30s right now uh, there is some ice on the water over there on the shallow part of the pond so i expect all the fish are going to be in the deepest part so we're going to head right out there and get started there so the water's definitely cooling down out here um don't know if you guys can see this but that's ice Well, the ice is still thin enough that we're plowing right through it. Uh, trying to get over here to the overpass for the highway. This is the deepest part of the pond. Uh, so hopefully the, the fish are stacked up over here. All right, guys, so we're back here at the house. I didn't catch anything today. And I just realized something. It's uh, 2021 and I haven't caught a fish yet. So I've officially been skunked for 2021 so far. We've been out twice now and I haven't caught a fish. So the only way to remedy that is to get back out on the water, keep casting, and eventually something's gonna bite it. So I'm gonna get back out there later this week, get some more footage, and uh, we're gonna catch a fish. I don't even care how big it is. I don't care what species it is. I just can't let it go like this. And uh, being skunked is not something that any angler wants. And uh, so we got to get out there. We got to make it happen. And I'm going to get you the footage for that this week. And again, if you haven't seen my last video of my dad and I flipping in the kayak, uh, like I said, freezing cold water. And uh, just, just make sure you check on that video. Click on it like it subscribe to the channel now later this week i am gonna catch a fish what's up everybody so i'm back out here again uh, i couldn't just let it go the other day i couldn't catch a fish so we're back out here same pond it is sunny today you can see how nice and bright it is out here it's a shallow pond so the fish are going to be drawn back up here into the shallower water uh, along this edge and yeah, the wind's blowing this way sorry if there's a lot of background noise but the wind's blowing this way so we're on the wind blown side side of the pond so uh, i think we're going to have a lot of luck but we're not going to be fishing for bass so i haven't had any luck lately so we're going to slow it down and uh we're going to use some hot dog and uh some corn so what i picked today was a uh, a hot dog that is chicken and pork and i've mixed it with strawberry jello and some garlic powder and the the corn i'm gonna throw one of those on the bottom let it sit try to catch some carp and then i'm also gonna put one on a uh a light rig with a bobber see if we can catch some bluegill like i said i do not care what i catch today i gotta catch something so 
that's the plan. Let's get them all rigged up. All right, so this is the nasty catfish food. Like I said, it's hot dogs, strawberry jello, and garlic powder. Smells terrible, but that's what we're after. You guys ever seen that movie, Forgetting Sarah Marshall, with uh, Paul Rudd and Jason Segel? And uh, Paul Rudd's out there as a surf instructor and uh, basically says, less is more. Uh, that's what today's all about. He says, uh, don't do anything. Don't try to surf, don't do it. The less you do, the more you do. So that that's the plan today. We're gonna do less and, uh, and we're gonna see if we can get some more out of it. All right, so we have the carp rig all rigged up. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and throw some corn on the hook. I have already thrown some in the water, so I've chummed it a little bit while I've been waiting. Um, there's been some corn sitting out there for a little bit. And we're gonna get this in the water and see what happens. All right, now we're gonna set up the uh, catfish rig with the hot dogs. All right, I got the circle hook on the uh, catfish rig. Time to open up this nasty smelling stuff and uh, put it on the hook. Oh my goodness. This stuff smells terrible. I picked this, um, you work with raw chicken, which works really well, but you have to worry about it um, giving you salmonella and out here cleaning your hands. So I'd rather just go with a hot dog And then we just sit and wait. Let's do nothing, guys. All right, guys, well, the quest continues. I did not catch a fish again. I rigged up a rod for carp fishing, rigged up a rod for cat fishing, and then I rigged up a small rod with a bobber for uh, some pan fishing. I was gonna try to catch some crappie or some bluegill, but uh, failed to do that too. I can't have a video without catching fish, so I'm just gonna continue, uh, continue the saga. And uh, we're gonna try to get out there again in the next couple days, and I will catch a fish in 2021. It's, it's as simple as that. I'm gonna catch a fish in 2021. All right, guys, we're back. Back out here again. Uh, like I said, day three. And uh, we're, I'm feeling pretty good about today. It's pretty cloudy. Um, not gonna help much, but it's been like 50 degrees the last three days. I'm really hoping it woke these fish up, so. I'm gonna stick with the same thing that I did last time. Less is more. I'm gonna throw out the uh, hot dog concoction again and some corn on a bobber. And we're gonna catch some fish today. I can tell you right now we're gonna catch some fish. So let's uh, let's get to it. Back up here a bit so we can see this other rod. But man, I love this spot. Um, like I said, it's a friend's neighborhood pond. It's completely tree covered all the way around. So. On the walk down here, the wind was pretty bad. Get back here uh, fishing and the wind calms right down. So you can't ask for much more while you're out here. And like I said, it's gonna be like 50 degrees today and we've got wind coverage. So I'm looking to catch some fish. I've actually got a little bit of time today. So we're gonna make it happen. All right, so I thought I had a nibble and uh, sure enough, I reel back in and there is a big juicy bite taken out of this. So I'm gonna, Put some more on, throw it back out in the same area and see if we can't get this one to actually catch the hook. Looks like he ate right around it. On the catfish rig. Yep, we got one. It's a good one too. All right, stay on, stay on, stay on. Stay on. Oh, she's running. Come on, come on. The bass. Yes. All right, guys. We finally got one. The skunk is off. 2021 has begun. Yes. Oh, man. Gulped it. Swallowed it all the way in there. We got to try to figure it out how to get this out of its belly. All right, so we got the hook out. Nice little bass. We're going to get this back in the water here in a second. Beautiful why we come out here guys it's why we come out here all right here we go buddy thank you all right that is awesome all right let's get back in the water it actually took the uh the hot dog the uh hot dog was supposed to be out here catching catfish but 
Hey, we'll take a bass, absolutely. All right, guys, we got another bite on the uh, catfish rod. I'll tighten down the drag this time. All right, yep, we got one. Really need to oil this thing. Another good one. I think it's a bass again. Oh yeah, she's fighting. All right. All right, guys. Bass number two. This one's a little bit better than the last one. A little bit better. Nice, pretty bass. Yes. That's what I'm talking about, guys. Come out here uh, with some hot dogs and... Like I said, it's a hot dog jello and garlic mixture, and these bass are loving it. Um, I decided to uh, size it down a little bit and not have such big chunks on there, and it seems to be doing the trick. All right, there we go. Bass number two. It's probably, I'd say, another one and a quarter, one and a half pounder. Nothing big, but... Uh, I just love it. We're out here catching fish, and uh, that's the whole point of today. 2021 has officially begun. The fishing season is here, and uh, got ourselves a nice, pretty bass. All right, let's get this back in the water. Get out of here, girl. Yeah, I made the horrible mistake of not oiling the reels after my dad and I fell in the pond a couple weeks ago. And now, as you guys as you guys can hear on here, it just sounds awful. It's grinding, and uh, I really need to get that done today when we get out of here. Just, just a little word of advice. Just keep your equipment uh, running smoothly and nice, and it'll treat you well. All right, so the skunk is off. I caught two bass uh, using hot dogs on a catfish setup. So I uh, wasn't expecting that, but now that I know the bass are awake, i um, kind of excited and <laughs> I tied on a rattle trap and a, um, a Senko and we're gonna wacky rig it and I'm gonna walk the bank now, I just can't help it. So I came out here expecting to catch some catfish and uh, just, just letting the hot dog sit out there and sure enough started catching bass and I can't help myself I know I said less is more but I'm starting to have fun we're catching fish and I'm gonna mix it up a bit and we're on guys got one uh-oh we're hung up let's keep them thin stuck up in the, uh, the junk here Nice little bass. There we go. It's exactly what we're after. Uh, through the wacky rig. And a uh, nice little hook on the top lip. Look at that. She's beautiful. All right. We're going to put her back in over here. I think we found where they're at. So I fished both ends and I didn't get anything. Um, came down here to the middle. Threw out one time. I might have uh, might have bounced it two or three times off the bottom and sure enough she hit and it's right in the area where the hot dog's been working too so uh, I think we got them um, I'm gonna throw the rattle trap out there next to see what we can get like they're all about the same size man I hope I'm not catching the same fish uh, over and over again uh, there's no way that's possible but but yeah another one and a half pounder so let's get a good release on her Oh, look at this. I knew they were catfishing here. That's a, a dead catfish on the ground right now. So we never like to see that, but that'll uh, make a good, a good meal for a fox or something out here. Don't know how I missed that one, guys, but um, I literally just got done saying 
Uh, do you ever have a feeling that you're about to catch a fish and uh, hooked up right then? I uh, love when that happens. Um, so another one on on the old wacky rig, and uh, this one's a little bit chunkier than the last two. Uh, another pretty fish, but we're still only in the. I'd say this one's almost two pounds, but um, look at it. That's a nice, pretty fish. Doing the old flex. All right, well that about wraps it up. Uh, this is the third day that we went fishing in 2021. Um, had to catch a fish today. So we had gone out twice before, hadn't caught anything. Uh, first day on the kayak and then a little bit of bank fishing at this exact pond. And then the second time we went out and uh, we switched the whole game up. We slowed everything down. We uh, set up some cat fishing rigs and um, even one for carp. Uh, threw corn out there, made a hot dog mixture, a um, little bit of catfish bait, homemade stuff, and then um, we were we were looking to catch anything, anything that was swimming. Well, we came out here today and we got it done, but it wasn't exactly what we thought was going to happen. So I came out here uh, trying to catch some catfish, and but I had a blast today, and um, we are no longer skunked for 2021. So, like I said before at the beginning, go ahead and like, subscribe, and comment on this video if you have any comments, or you, anything you want to add, any tips for catfishing, because I obviously don't know what I'm doing, but that was a, it was a good time getting out here and doing this. So, as always, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll catch you next time on Grippin' or Rippin'.